Brandy Melville is a one-size-only phenomenon. It represents what every 12 to 25 year old girl wants to be. They really made their mark selling reasonably priced basics. They have a pretty strange business model. Olive oil, restaurants, a recording studio, and that's when we realized this has got to be a front because there's something much bigger going on here. Girls are obsessed with this brand. This is my rare Brandy Bubble collection. I started collecting during the Alien era, and at one point, I had every item sold. They don't do sales, they don't do promos, and despite how much you might spend, they don't offer free shipping. They gave out postcards and stickers, which we took like trophies for being brave enough to shop there. Not only was it this hugely successful business, but it was also a hugely successful cult. The day that I had a piece of clothing named after me was the day that I knew I was part of the cult. We were instructed to lead anyone in the store over 120 pounds to the jewelry wall in the back. It was mean. There's no other way to describe it. I went to shop in stores with one of my friends and I remember standing outside and telling her, I don't think I can go in there. And she was like, no, you're a size four, you're gonna be fine. And I said, no, I don't think I can fit through the doorway. The skinny doors were notorious. As employees, we had a saying, if she don't fit, she ain't it. None of the dressing room curtains ever closed all the way. Everything might've been one size only, but nowhere did it say one size fits all.